What's going on YouTube? It's Andrew over here at Andrew Lifts. I got a new video from you guys, for you guys. I'm out here in my own garage, right? Why am I in my garage? As you guys know, the city of Atlanta is not allowing people to go to the gym. That was bad, right? It's funny because uh, a lot of people are really focused and still going to my gym before this band came up, you know. So I got a video for you guys about how to train and make gains at your own garage or basement or room, wherever you have open space. You know, I don't have a huge amount of space, but we got a decent amount so you can see to work with. How you can make Gains, right, with just this curl bar. Check it out. All right, uh, so when we know this epidemic's hitting everybody hard, I hope y'all are staying safe, staying clean. Uh, most importantly, you know, I hope you, you're staying with the, you know, in a safe, secure spot. Um, but anyways, so, I'm gonna show you guys a shoulder workout today and bring some light to the world. Uh, so, really guys, all you need is a curl bar. The reason why is you can do so many things with a curl bar, right? You can do arms, you know, bicep curls, inside, outside curls. You can do reverse curls, right? Uh, you can work your shoulder, do shoulder press, reverse shoulder press safely with a chair, which I'll show you. But this one's gonna be about shoulders, guys, and how you can, you know, really get shoulders in when you're at your house. It can even be a pretty good um, workout if, let's say, you're trying to catch somebody somewhere, you don't have time to go all the way to your gym or go out of the way. Hey, this is, this is kind of a double-edged sword, I think, that we all should have an option for training at our house if need be, so. Check it out guys, let's see what we can do. Uh, anyways guys, be sure to subscribe, like, comment, if you like the content that I'm providing you. All right guys, so the first workout we're gonna do in our shoulder workout is we're gonna do a shoulder press standing up. So what that involves, you're gonna have your curl bar here. You know, I've just got not a ton of weight, 65 pounds. Keep in mind, the weight will feel a bit more uh, compressed because I got a shorter bar and it's close to my body. If you got a barbell, you can do this as well with whatever weight you're comfortable with. The number one thing to do is to get this weight up safe. We do a power clean. Power clean always starts in the legs, goes to your hips, and ends with your head tilted up. Okay, you want to be safe about this. So grab your bar. Bring up to my knee level. What's your knee level? Right about a squat position almost. You're coming up from squat. Come up like that. And then you're gonna flip your wrist. Come back down that squat level. Just like that. One smooth motion. Then we'll do our shoulder press. Just like so. Be sure to push up through the shoulders, guys. Keep your grip about shoulder length. Keep that bar about two inches in front of your neck, like that. All right, guys. That's pretty much it when you're, when you're letting the weight down. Turn the weight, flip over your wrist to your quads and bring it down like a deadlift. And then for reps, you want to do 10 reps with five sets intact. And again, like I said, you can do this with a curl bar, a barbell. Once again, guys, the goal is to you know, get that workout in and to still squeeze on that muscle group. Those are main goals. You can add weight and have fun with it too there if you want to, but definitely you know, try to go up in weight a little bit as you 
you do it time over time. So, but we'll show you my next workout. Safety tip guys. The next workout is behind the neck shoulder press. You want to do this workout. If you've never done behind the neck shoulder press, then grab a partner, grab a brother, a friend, your mom. If your mom can handle the weight that you're lifting, which, hey, there's some strong, super strong moms out there. Uh, but definitely you need a partner if you never did this workout before. If you had, you know, just be careful, follow the technique that I'm showing you. All right, guys. Go to the safe in the way up. So the legs, now we want to get in a starting position. Safely, you know, everything's about saving our body, making it better. I get in a hurt, so flip this way up. Catch it on the top of your chest. Push up. Lean into your seat. Lean the weight down at about 90 degrees. And push where you're directly coming in contact with the back of your head. down as you keep and then we're focused on your delts we're gonna do 50 we're gonna do 15 whole reps with you guys let's go for three three sets pretty much it guys for the workout I got for y'all uh, be sure if you have not already definitely subscribe like comment if you got a thought comment about you know how your workout start going during this time of you know that whole virus situation the mini apocalypse we're having uh, so post what's going on with you guys we know we know these are, you know, different times right now, but we gotta all stick together and be positive. That's the only way through this, guys. All right, stay tuned. I'm gonna post another workout for you guys next time of how to 
just train at your house. The gym shut down and want to be, you just want to, you know, be safe and prove your, prove your gains. So, I'll talk to you guys soon.